Good morning, it's Shelby from the Queen's Cabinet, and today I'd like to share my refrigerator bran muffin recipe with you. Are you excited? <laughs> well, I've been making this recipe, I want to say from uh, the 70s. It was on that um, old cooking show, The Frugal Gourmet. I wrote it down on a napkin, and I've been making it ever since. And this recipe's uh, pretty neat because you can make the batter and it stores in the refrigerator up to six weeks. So you can bake off one muffin or up to 36 muffins. And um, it's just a really convenient thing to have, um, especially when you have busy mornings. Nutrition wise, there's 172 calories, four and a half grams of protein, and almost three grams of fiber. Anyway, here's my brand muffin recipe. I hope you guys enjoy it. You will need four cups of bran cereal, two cups of bran flake cereal, five cups of all-purpose flour, one quart of buttermilk, five teaspoons of baking soda, four eggs, two cups of boiling water. The very first thing you want to do is add the baking soda to the water and then let this cool. I'm going to give it a stir and then just set it aside to cool down. In addition, you need one half cup of butter and two cups of sugar. We're going to go ahead and start creaming this. After you cream the sugar and butter, start adding your eggs one at a time. Then start alternating the flour with the buttermilk until it's completely incorporated. The batter should look something like this. I've added the batter to the bowl with the cereal. I'm going to get this all mixed up. Now that the cereal and the batter has been mixed together, I'm going to add that water that had the baking soda added to it and get this blended as well. And this is what your batter should look like. Now you're going to want to store this in the refrigerator for 24 hours before using it and it'll keep for up to six weeks. It makes 36 muffins and you can bake them one at a time or you could bake all 36 at a time. It's so convenient. I'm going to store the batter in the refrigerator for at least 24 hours before using the batter. It's Sunday morning and I portioned out just six muffins. That's all I need for today. I'm going to cook these off before we go to church and then when we get back we can have a more substantial meal. But at least if our pastor goes a little long today, <laughs> we'll make it through a sermon. 